the Queen of Gothic, Cathedral of Notre Dame, former Abbey of Saint Remy, and Palace of Tau, Reims. Reims is the main city in the Champagne region known for its sparkling wine production. Its majestic Notre Dame Cathedral is inscribed on the World Heritage List. It's known as the Queen of Gothic for its graceful appearance. The cathedral is considered a masterpiece of stone art. Over 2,300 stone statues carved on its walls tell biblical and mythological stories. These images had a special meaning to a public during medieval times, a public which was largely illiterate. A statue of the Virgin Mary with a gracious smile welcomes those who enter the cathedral. At her side are the statues of smiling angels. Their warm expressions contrast with the stone from which they've been sculpted. The cathedral's overwhelming size and grandeur are breathtaking. The ceiling is 38 metres high, which is equivalent to a 12-storey building. To support the cathedral, narrow and broad columns were combined. It's an architectural device to lighten the visual aspect of the massive amounts of stone used in their construction. The sculptor Auguste de Rodin commented in his writings that these columns are like a magnificent man-made forest dedicated to God. The cathedral was a sanctuary for many. It was the place where hungry people were fed with warm food and the sick were cared for. For hundreds of years, the Cathedral of Notre Dame in Reims has protected the French people regardless of their social status. Today, it's also popular with visitors to the Champagne region interested in the local history and the history of architecture. <laughs>